currently 1.49 and I'm leaving Jordan's house. I actually already left, went to the gas station and realized I left my vlog camera at her house, which like, I feel like that's like the biggest thing to remember and I just totally forgot. But I just ran back and grabbed it, obviously. And I'm gonna drive home and go back to slow. And I don't know if I'll like, maybe I'll do like a Q and A when I get back to slow or something for this vlog, just cause I'll just be in the car the whole day. And I know I'll be like tired tonight cause I leave to fly home tomorrow. So it'll be very, very chill. But I'll get to see Lolo again so you guys can see her. And that's really about it. So I'm gonna text my parents that I'm leaving so they know I'm safe and alive. And I will talk to you guys along the way. I'll probably have to stop for food because we had breakfast, but for some reason I feel like I'm just gonna be hungry. And I already got gas, so that's good. And I will see you guys in a bit. Happy Vlogmas Day 12. I am literally all packed up. I've been a kind of a bad vlogger today because I spent the whole morning doing laundry and packing because I'm going home for Christmas. I'm so excited. I have my suitcase and my duffel bag and I'm literally gonna wear two jackets on the plane because I just was trying to fit so much stuff in my suitcase. I would genuinely like not be surprised if it exploded and broke, but I am about to leave. Lolo's gonna drive me to the airport and I do have a layover and it's gonna be a really chill day but I know that I have a lot of packages to unbox when I get home. My guess is that will be like the majority of the vlog. So I need to go because we're leaving like right now, but I'm gonna bring you along. this video long enough or postable enough because the past two days have just been kind of like really chill travel days didn't vlog that much was on a plane for a lot of it or was just driving back to slow so I thought I would finally do like kind of the unboxing or random like PR or just random things I bought in haul that I've been meaning to do for so long that has been sitting in the corner of my room. I just cleaned up my room and this is like what one corner looks like. It's really not like that much but it's definitely like substantial amount that I thought I would show you guys. So it's basically just like a little travel vlog plus a haul. Also, some of these things are Christmas gifts. So Anna or mom, don't watch. This company that I'm gonna need to be able to pronounce it correctly. They sent me perfume and I'm so excited. I purposely, I like opened the box, but I didn't open it because I wanted to smell it like on camera. I'm gonna put the brand name on the screen. I know I'm not gonna be able to pronounce it correctly, but it's called Bon Parf. I don't know, it's like French, it's from Paris. Come on camera, my camera has some horrible time focusing, but this is what the packaging looks like, like really, really, really nice. And I picked out a scent, it's 301. Like I feel so stupid, so I'm just gonna put it on the screen. But I am finally getting to open it with you guys, I'm so excited. I have been so curious about what this is not like for so long. And the packaging is so nice, so I guess that slides off. And it's just a little box, and that is so cute. Oh my god. Oh, I can tell this is gonna smell good. It looks like this. I'll link like their website or if they gave me a code or anything down below. Oh my god. Okay, you know what this reminds me of? You know when you go to the perfume section at the mall or like in a store and like all of the scents like combine and it's kind of like one like overall scent? I don't know if that's just me that notices that, but that is what this smells like. It's like has some floral, but it also has like darker tones. Okay, I sound so like stupid, but it smells really good. I recommend. I know this is like the bigger bottle and I know that their perfumes are like 
I would say like comparable to other like nice perfume prices. I remember looking at their website. So thank you so much for sending me this. It's like literally so nice and so like, smells very mature is what I would say. It's not like a pink sugar vibe at all, if that helps helps explain it because clearly I'm doing a horrible job. Also, I don't know what happened on my flight, but oh my God, I like hurt my back so bad. I can like, I need a massage really bad. Anyways, okay, this package is from Sephora. Mom, I actually don't watch this because this is one of the other skincare items I got you. I hope you clicked off the video already. She wanted, like I mentioned in my Christmas shopping vlogmas, I think, she wanted like some nice, good, clean skincare. So I know that this is like, has a little Allure award on it. And I know Emma Chamberlain loves it. Hiram said it was good. I know it's like pretty popular. The Use of the People Kale and Green Tea Spinach Vitamins Superfood Cleanser. That is a mouthful, but it came with a pump. It was like open, but it looks like this. Seems pretty awesome and hopefully she'll like this. I know my sister texted me and she got her skincare too. So we'll probably have to figure out what we all got her because I have a feeling that like she's gonna get like so much skincare stuff for Christmas so we're gonna need to figure that out. But hopefully she likes that. I'll keep you guys updated if she does. Then we have some items from Princess Polly. I ordered these like not on Black Friday, maybe it was Black Friday. I actually might've been still in slow like for the first time. And it took a long time to ship because of the Black Friday sales and all that. And I'm trying to figure out how I wear this top and I have no idea, but I'm gonna do like try-ons of these and this is like somehow on the front of it. But the quality of this is like so, so nice. It's so soft and silky and it's like really shiny and I can tell that like in a really cute flash photo, this will photograph really, really well. And I'm always a big fan of getting new tops like this to switch up what I wear because once I wear a shirt once, I swear it's like not cute to me anymore, which is so dumb. I know it's so dumb, but I like always think that. Okay, then I always do this too. I look at the models and I see like cute outfits they're wearing and then I buy like their outfit that they're wearing, like whatever pants they're wearing with the shirt. And so I saw this on the model and I literally like, that's why I purchased the order and then I saw that top later. It's a super, super cute, like light yellow knit, like midi skirt, I believe. And it has a slit on the side. I got it in a size small slash medium and it, it's like perfect because it's like it really like hugs your body and plus it's just like I was shocked by how amazing quality this is like it is so thick and nice it feels like it could be like a hundred dollars from Revolve or something which obviously it's a lot more affordable at Princess Polly and I also feel the same exact way about this sweater like I think this is like one of the nicest sweaters I own and like it would be comparable to like a really expensive uh, revolve sweater I feel like plus I think the pattern is so so cool definitely reminds me of like a, a California type of sweater but the model is wearing these two together and I thought that was sick like I don't know why but I just like loved it and so I got this and it has really really big sleeves and I can't wait to tuck this into the skirt and I'm definitely gonna get some cute pictures in this so make sure you guys follow my Instagram but overall I'm like obsessed with all of those pieces like they were like my expectation was here and they were up here type of thing. I ordered some stuff from Adika. Now, unfortunately, I had a really cool vision and it didn't exactly follow through. But I'm going to show you guys anyways because it looked really cute on the model. So I did that thing again where I ordered the exact outfit off the model. And I got this really, really big button-up shirt that you like wear under sweaters. Sorry, it's wrinkly because clearly I've been actually putting them in a pile in my corner of my room. But it's just like this pink and like different shade of pink and tan, really big button up. And the whole point is to obviously wear it under a sweater. So the model was wearing this exact sweater over it. And so I was like, oh, perfect. That looks so good on her. I hope it's up on the website. I will literally do like a comparison of what it looks like on me. But I guess it just like didn't work out. This is the sweater and I think it's just too like wide and not like long enough because also the shirt was pretty short on me. Like I wouldn't really be able to wear it as an actual dress. And it's a little bit itchy, but I've like loved all the stuff I order from Adika normally, so I don't know. But yeah, that was a miss, except clearly it was a hit for the model and probably other people who ordered it, but just not for me. Um, I also got these clips, which they came out to be a lot bigger <laughs> than I expected, but my whole idea was wearing this like pink one with the sweater and the shirt because it's like the same color pink as in the um, button down, but because they're a little bit bigger than I expected and I'm gonna return that just cause it does not look good. I think I'm just gonna return these two because I want to see myself really wearing these too much 
anyways but it was the right idea i tried to be trendy i really tried i put in the work just not, might not be my trend but now it's gonna sound so so silly but the sweatpants i'm wearing which are really really fuzzy like extremely fuzzy white sweatpants are from target and i actually got them the other week when i was vlogging my christmas shopping and i found this sports bra and honestly you guys like we need to stop sleeping on Target. It actually has like really, really good stuff. This is the sports bra. It's just like a little bit longer and navy and ribbed. And I just thought it was just like cute to like wear with leggings on like a walk or whatever. Cause I like that it's a little bit longer and I don't have a ton that are this like length, even though I feel like I'll wear this more than my normal ones. So I just got this and it was literally like, it's super stretchy, really nice quality. And I'm pretty sure it was only like $20. I think they like Joy Lab, which is like the brand of this, and Target have this like new line there. And it was like all really, really cute. So highly recommend. I'll stand on my chair. These are the sweatpants I got too. So, so cute and really comfy. And they were also $20 and I've like literally not taken them off. So that's that. Found some pore strips in the corner. Got those, which I definitely need to do one of those because when I go on an airplane and I wear my mask for that long, I swear it makes my pores like enlarge but lastly on a don't watch this but i have been wearing this sweatshirt in my all my vlogs recently you guys have probably noticed and i got one for my sister too when i ordered it and so this one's hers obviously i haven't like worn it or anything but it's from moon doggies which is the surf so shop in slow that's like what their logo looks like i don't know i think it was really cute and she like always is like wants like the big sweatshirts or whatever that i always wear that she says because i have like a ton of sweatshirts and I thought that would be perfect because it's like slow too, which is just cool. And I wanted to order it for myself, so I just used it kind of as an excuse. So I hope she likes it, but I think she will. And that is my big random PR haul. I'll link all of the websites that I mentioned down below. And if I have any codes and thanks for sticking through all these Vlogmas videos with me. I know this one was a little bit random, but you guys did say you wanted me to unbox these boxes. So I figured might as well throw it into a vlog I don't have a lot of footage of. And now I'm gonna clean up this large mess I just made in like 10 minutes. And I will see you guys in my next vlogmas video. Bye.